Hello. Hello, teacher. Welcome, Margarita. Hi, teacher. Hello, hello, Geralda. Welcome, welcome. Hi, teacher. Hello. Hello, teacher. Hello, Wilfredo. Welcome. How was your day, teacher? I'm fine, thank you. Oh, good. You, Wilfredo? I'm fine, too. Oh, good. It was a good day for me. Excellent. Very good. Jose Antonio, hello. Welcome. Hi, teacher. Hi. Thank you. Nice to see you again, eh? Yes. Okay. So let's begin. Let me see. We're going to start with the with the manual, right? Manual. We are going to practice. We are going to practice and we are, hello, Emer, welcome. Hello, teacher. Hello. And later I will pass the, the attend, right? So let me see here. <coughs> <coughs> Okay, yesterday we were working with unit three. Where do you work, right? And the objective was yesterday, right? Ask for a question, right? And say time of activities of, at our workplace, right? Okay, good. Then here we have the agenda of Mrs. Robles. Mrs. Robles is a woman, of course, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, and before to start, let me tell you this, right? Uh, Margarita, what time do you exactly start working? Santa Ana. Uh huh, but the time? Tick tock, tick tock, what time? Um. Eight o'clock, seven o'clock, nine o'clock. Um, six. Six o'clock. Oh, very early, right? How about you, Esmeralda? What time do you finish working? At 4.30 p.m. 4.30 a.m.? 4.30 p.m. Ah, p.m. <laughs> 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 it was in the morning, right? Okay. And what time do you have lunch, Jose Antonio? Thank what? You. Jose Antonio, what time do you have lunch? Mm, does, well, 12 p.m. At 12 p.m., right? At noon. At noon, okay, thank you, thank you very much. Now, this is the agenda of Mrs. Robles. Okay, at 7.15, meeting with the marketing department. At 8.30, video call with the supervisor from West Company. At nine o'clock, workshop to the research and development department to improve the manufacturing process. At 12 o'clock at noon, right? She has workshop, workshops lunch. 145, second part of the workshop. Taller, taller, workshop, right? Workshop. Okay. And 5.55, send tomorrow's schedule to Ms. Lopez. La agenda del día de mañana, right? Send tomorrow's schedule, tomorrow's schedule to Ms. Lopez, right? Okay, good. Now, let me see. Carmen, please. I need you to tell me about this activity of Mrs. Robles. 
you're going to tell me. At six, uh, 7 15, Mrs. Robles has. At 7 15, Mrs. Robles has a meeting with the. Uh, uh, okay. At 8 30, Mrs. Robles has a video call, etc. Et right, Carmen? Let's start with the, the first one, right? 7 15. Uh, disculpe, teacher. Bueno, vengo ingresando a la plataforma. Si me yes, dicen but... que está. Yes, don't worry, Carmen. This is nothing new, right? No hemos visto nada nuevo. Solo es la información de, de la señorita, la señora Robles, perdón. Ajá. Ok, so, I want you to tell me. Mrs. Robles has... Has meeting. Mm -hmm. With? With the marketing department. At... At uh, seven, seven fifteen. At seven, seven fifteen, fifteen, right? Fifteen. 15. Oh, a quarter after seven. A quarter mm -hmm. after seven. Good. Email, please. Eight thirty. Mrs. Robles Miss, has, Mrs. 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 Robles has video call with the supervisor from West Company. Excellent. At at eight thirty. Good, thank you. Rebecca, at nine, please. Mrs. Robes has the nine. Uh, okay, workshop. Mrs. Robles has a workshop. Ah. Uh, Mrs. Robert has a workshop to research and develop department to improve the ma manufacturing process. At? At? At night. At nine o'clock, good, thank you. Okay. Now, let me see, uh, Esmeralda, please, 12. Mrs. Robles has 12 o'clock workshop lunch. Okay, or oh, Mrs. Robles has a workshop lunch. Uh -huh. Say it again, please, Emma. Say it Mrs. again. Mrs. Robles oh. has. Mrs. has workshop lunch. At? At 12 club oh you can say at noon right at noon oh, uh, jose please 145 or a quarter to two mm, 145 seconds part wait 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 mrs robles forest. mrs robles ah. has mr robles no no no, no. mrs Mr. is a man, right? Mr. Like Mr. Moreno, for example, right? In this case, it's a woman, it's a lady, is married. Dun, dun, da, dun, 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 dun. It's just married, right? Mrs. Mrs. Okay, come on. Mrs. Robles. Has? Mrs. Robles has second part of the workshop. At? 1.45. 1.45. Right, PM, I suppose, right? So, or or a quarter to two, a quarter to two, right? Thank you, Jose. And let me see, Alexis, help me, please. Five fifty-five or five to to six, right? Ready, Alexis? Me podía. Okay. Okay. Let me see. We are telling what are the activities Mrs. Robles is making. What activities is is she making, right? For example, Mrs. Robles has a meeting with the marketing department at seven fifteen. Mrs. Robles has a video call 
with the supervisor from West Company at 8.30. Mrs. Robles has a workshop to the research and development department to improve the manufacturing process at nine o'clock. Mrs. Robles has a workshop lunch at noon or at 12 o'clock. Mrs. Robles has a second part of the workshop at 1.45. Okay, Alexis? Mrs. Robles. Alexis, can you hear me? Okay, so uh, Fatima, help me, Fatima. In this case, Mrs. Robles sends, right? Mr. Robles sent tomorrow is to, no sé cómo se pronuncia Ske, eso. Ske, Ske, special. Ske, special. Special to Miss Lopez, new secretary and leave at five, um, 55. Uh -huh. 55, correct, very good. So those are the activities, thank you, Fatima. Those are the activities for Mrs. Robles. Okay, now we'll take attendance. Eh, Alexis está teniendo problemas con internet. No hay problema, Alexis. Cuando pueda, participe. Cuando no voy a entender que, que hay problemitas ahí. No, no hay problema, sí. Okay, Silvia. Candy. Present teacher. Carmen. Present teacher. Doralicia. Te doy puerta, pero en el aire. Eric. Present teacher. Fátima. Present. Esmeralda. Present teacher. Francisco. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Gisela. Present teacher. Ok. Eh, Héctor. Imer. Present. Irving. Jose Antonio. Present teacher. Jose Roberto. Present teacher. Good, welcome. ¿Todo bien, Jose Roberto? Todo bien, solo que bien. por el momento no voy a tener la cámara, pero ya estoy trabajando en eso. Vaya, ok, está bien, sí, porque ayer vi que tuvo algunos problemitas con la internet, ¿verdad? Sí, así es. Sí, ok, no hay problema. Ahí arréglese. Lo importante es que participe. Ok. María. Gracias. Present. Alexis. Bueno, Alexis está ahí, ¿verdad? Pero creo que no, no, no le alcanza para contestar. Pero ahí está. Veamos. Permítanme. Bueno, pero ahí estamos. Silvia. Present, present teacher. Good. Thank you. Eh, Oscar. Oscar. Rebeca. Present. Wilfredo. Present. Good. Thank you. Thank you very much. Good. So let's continue, right? Now we're going teacher. to make some questions. Yes? Eh, yes, Margarita. A mí no, no me nombró. Ah, oh, yeah. yeah. Por la eh, lista, Margarita. Pero no. yes. uh -huh. de, de, la cosa es que él había tomado la asistencia, pero sí tiene razón para que, para ah, okay. el concepto de, de que quede registrado para, para Insafor, ¿verdad? ¿no? Okay. Sí, Margarita. Okay, good, thank you. Okay, before I forget, eh, María, ¿puede quedarse conmigo 10 minutos? Claro que sí, teacher. Okay, very good. Very good. Vamos a ver, José Antonio, ya estuvo, ¿verdad? Ah, perdón, José Roberto, eh, con usted ya me quedé a los 10 minutos. Hello, teacher. Eh, con usted no me he quedado los extra 10 minutos, ¿verdad? 
No. No, todavía. No, no, no. Para, entonces, para mañana, no. doctor. Sí. Para mañana. Sí, de acuerdo. Ok, gracias, gracias. gracias. Ok, good. So, let's, let's continue, right? Good. Now we're going to work like this, right? It says, read the information again, de nuevo, right? Again. Otra vez, right? To answer the questions. Compare with a partner, it says. So we have question number one. What time is the video call with the West company? What time is the video call with the West company? Number two, what time does the workshop with the research department start? A que hora comienza, right? The workshop. What time is the video? A que hora el video, la video llamada? Y a que hora comienza el, el taller con el, el departamento de investigación, research department, right? You can see here. And number three, what time does the company close? What time does the company close? Okay, this is very difficult because it's, uh, you have to jump into a conclusion, right? Tenemos que llegar a una conclusión con eso. ¿Qué hora cierra la compañía? ¿Qué hora cierra la oficina? Yes? Okay, so let's think about it again. I repeat for the last time the questions. Question number one, what time is the video call with the West company? Number two, what time does the workshop with the research department start? And what time does the company close, right? Good. So I need volunteers. Let's go with the first one, right? What time is the video call? Yes, Gisela? A, 18 past half. A? 18, eh, perdón, 8 past half. Okay, wait, wait a minute, it's 8.30, right? Ah, 8.30. 30. Or a half pass. Five. A half pass. Thirteen. A half past thirty, right? Yes. Ah, no, a half past eight, sorry. <laughs> half past eight, right? Good. Let me show you. Let me show you. Let me show you. Let me show you. Good. A, 30, right? Aha, uh -huh, I missed that one channel. A, 30, in a second. ¿Qué pasa ahí? Ah, me están traveseando. Me están asustando. Ahí estamos, A, 30. Good. So we have two options here. Look, we have it's eight thirty, right? It's eight thirty or it's half past. Eight, right. Look, these are the two options. It's A30. Or in this case, because we're talking about the meaning, it's at A30, right? Or is at we're talking about the meaning, right? Is at 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 a half, a half past eight, right? Uh, okay. Teacher. 
Yes. A mí me aparece solamente las primeras letras. No me aparece nada más. No lo veo, no tengo nada. ¿Y acá? No, ahí es como un lapicero, nada más. Uh, ¿Todos los demás todo lo ven el, la, mi pizarra? Sí, la sí, veo. Se ve sí. la veo. Pero, no, sí. sol, pero no veo lo que está escribiendo. Solamente aparecen tres letras. Mm, igual, bueno. teacher, igual que Margarita me pasa a mí, pero creo que es el internet. Teacher. Solo le están dando en la mitad del paquete. Hay que, hay que reclamarle. Perdón, perdón por el chiste. Pero sí. Yo lo veo completo, teacher. ¿Usted lo ve completo? No sí. sé si, si, Margarita, sí. si Margarita y Fátima es que están viéndolo en el teléfono. Qu quizás en el teléfono. No, yo estoy desde la computadora, pero está haciendo viento porque creo que ya viene el agua, entonces Ajá, creo que... Ah, pues sí tiene que ser el internet. Lo que pasa es que a veces cuando es en el teléfono y el maestro está usando pizarra, hay que, hay que girar el teléfono. Sí. Ah, sí, es cierto, hay que girar el teléfono. Ya entendí qué está pasando, sí. Teacher. Va, miren, Margarita, mire ahora, Margarita. Nada. Voy a, voy a girar la computadora, pues. No. <risa> Son bromas. Sí, bueno, entonces... Eh, Ah, ya sé qué voy a hacer en la, en la, en la presentación de, de PowerPoint. Voy a escribirlo, oiga. Ah, voy a mandar la captura para que vea lo que a mí me aparece. Si no, no le creo, no se preocupe. No, no tenga ah, okay. pena. Pero, pero lo, lo voy a escribir en el, en el otro, ¿verdad? En, el, en la otra presentación. Me recuerdo, ¿no? me recuerdo. Ok. Sigamos entonces con, con el manual. Ya... Ya leí su mensaje, ¿verdad? Este... Alexis, qué bueno que ya se estabilizó su, su internet, Alexis. Qué bueno. Ok, les continuo. Eh, Margarita, aquí no hay problema, ¿verdad? Sí se ve. Va, ok, muy bien. Good. Now, let's continue, right? Number one, what time is the video call with the West Company? What we say the West Company here, right? Is at 8:30. Lástima que aquí no puedo escribir. No me puede decir. At 8:30 or a half past eight. A half past eight, right? Good. Question number two, please, volunteers. It says, What time does the workshop with the research department start or begin? ¿A qué horas comienza, right? What time does the workshop with the research department start? At nine o'clock. At nine o'clock. Very good. So you can say the The workshop start at nine o'clock or simple at nine o'clock. Very good, thank you. Very good. Now, and the last question. This is the most difficult question, so pay attention. What time does the company close? It's six o'clock, teacher. At? Se le adelantaron, Wilfredo, lo siento. <laughs> at six o'clock. Yeah, at six o'clock, right? Because the last activity for Mrs. Robles is sent tomorrow's schedule to Mrs. Lopez. So, and leave. Mm -hmm. Leave, right? And this is important because at six o'clock, yeah, it's like kind of dark, right? It's not algo curito. Yes. Yes. In some company, for example, some people say there are some goals. Mm. En algunas compañías dicen la gente que asusta, ¿verdad? Así que el último que sale de la oficina es el que <ríe> le apaga y le enciende la luz de a veces. ¿verdad? So at six o'clock, you know? Okay, so it's time to, to close, to leave, right? Six o'clock. Teacher. Help me. Uh, in my factory, this is 
story are is true. Ah, okay. You have some ghosts. Yes. Some phantoms. I, ha I have some experience about. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Please don't tell. No, no me cuente porque si no Esmeralda no va a dormir ahora. Ow. <laughs> No, Wilfredo le tiene miedo también. Lo, no, no, no quiere, right? Hay muchas historias de niñitos mojados y de, y de señoras de blanco, ¿verdad? <laughs> okay, so uh, yesterday we were learning about how to use question with what time, right? So repeat after me, please. Repeat after me. What time is it? It's one. Oh, eight. What time does the meeting start? What time does the meeting start? What time does the meeting start? It starts at 11 o'clock. It starts at 11 o'clock. What time do you arrive at work? What time do you arrive at work? What time do you arrive at work? At about, at about 6.48, 6.48 a.m. At about 6.48 a.m. O about 6.48 a.m. What time do employees leave? What time do employees leave? What time do employees leave? Usually around 7 or 7.40. Usually around 7 or 7.40. Okay, so this is the, the way we make question with what time, right? Yesterday we were practicing the clock, right? And today we're going to make a practice with what time and the auxiliary do and das. The auxiliary of do and that, right? And we're going to complete this and make conversation, right? I'm going to start with Sylvia, please. You're going to help me, Sylvia. Uh, I need you're going to be uh, letter A, Sylvia. And Candy, you're going to be letter B, right? So in the case of Candy, you need to complete, right, Candy, this question before to start with the conversation, right? So, Candy, what is the question? Yes. What is the question, Candy? Eh, empiezo yo, teacher. Just make the question first, right? Primero vamos a hacer la, la pregunta y después vamos mm -hmm. a hacer la conversación con, con Silvia, yes? Okay. ¿Cuál sería la pregunta? Le vamos a dar su tiempo para que lo piense. <laughs> Really, what time it start? What time does? What time does really it start? No, okay, wait, 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 wait. El really dejémoslo para afuera, sí. Okay. What time? What time? Does it start? Good. So again, we have candy four part, right? Recuerdense que tenemos siempre cuatro partes. What time does it start? What time does it start, right? Okay, okay. Dokie. Now, uh, ready, Sylvia? Your letter A and candy's letter B. One, two, three, action. There is the 
the coming of new employee on Tuesday. Really, what time does it start? It starts at 9 a.m. Okay, doctor, right? Now, Carmen, Doralicia, ya se presentó Doralicia. Okay, no, entonces, Eric, no me ayudaré. Ah, Doralicia, ya estamos por ahí. Welcome, Doralicia. Okay, so Doralicia is going to be letter A. Vamos a hacerlo un poco más grande para que, permítanme un segundito. Para que no nos confundamos, ¿verdad? Aquí estamos. Ups. Ups, sí. Ahí estamos, ¿verdad? Ok. Eh, Doralicia, this is your part, right? Tomorrow I have to go to the photocopy center, right? It opens at 6 a.m., right? This is your part, Doralicia. La parte A va a ser usted, ¿ok? Mm -hmm. And eh, Carmen, Carmen, right? Carmen, I need you to complete the question, right? Me va a completar la pregunta, Carmen, y después va, me va a ir a la conversación con, con Doralicia, ¿ok? Recuerde que son cuatro partes, Dora, eh, perdón, eh, Carmen, por par, right? Echamos una mano. Vale. La primera parte sería. No, sí, eh, Carmen. Sí, Guatay. Sería Guatay. Ok. Guatay das. Das. Does it? No, no, okay. it? Wait, 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 Carmen. Pero aquí, en lugar del it, ya tenemos otro sujeto, mire. The photocopy. Center open. The mm -hmm. photocopy center. Y aquí mm -hmm. está ya el sujeto. Entonces, ya no necesitamos decir it, ¿verdad? Okay. Okay, again. Entonces, what okay. I does. Ajá. Uh -huh. The what photocopy. Uh -huh. The full copy center open. Open. Again, right? Si se fija, Carmen, uh -huh. todas las oraciones van así, ¿verdad? What time? Okay. Luego el auxiliar, luego el sujeto y luego open, que es el verbo, ¿verdad? Okay. Todas tienen cuatro partes, ¿sí? Ok. Ok, sí. ya estamos listos para la conversación con Doralicia. Ok, Doralicia. One, two, three. Sería la... Letra A, la letra A, letter A. Tomorrow. Tomorrow I, I, I have to go to the... Ay, no, no sé cómo se dice ahí. Foro, foro, foro. Godocopy Center. Godocopy Center. Me too. Me too. Me too. What time the photocopy center open? Sorry, Carmen. What time does? What time does the photocopy center open? It opens at six. Fifty. Sixteen. No, fifty. Fifty. Fifteen. Fifteen. I. A. A. M. A. M. Very good. Thank you. Okay, Carmen and Doralicia. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Give me a second, please. Okay, Eric Esmeralda, please. Can you help me with conversation three? Uh, in this case, Esmeralda, you're going to make the question for letter B, right? And later we're going to practice the conversation with Eric, right? Esmeralda, remember there are four parts, right? Recuérdese las cuatro partes. Teacher. 
La número yes. dos la hicimos. Es que me fui a la tres de un solo. I'm sorry. Ajá, es que eso, eso estoy viendo. Sí, de la uno nos pasamos a la tres. Okay. Así que perdón, Emeralda, regresemos a la dos. <ríe> Como están sobrepuestas ahí, me equivoqué. Bueno, ok, Emeralda. What is the question? Ya la, ya la tengo, teacher. Ok, come on. Este, ¿Quién va a preguntar? Le pregunto cuál es la pregunta aquí. Yes. Ah, ok. Entonces sería, what times do you arrive? Ok, what time? Listen, what Emeralda. Time. Time. Okay. Mm. Mm. What time? Good. What time do you arrive? Excellent. Excellent. Right? Now, Eric, ready? One, yes. two, three. Let's meet for the meetings on Wednesday. Great. What times do you arrive? I arrive at 8.15 p.m. 8.15 p.m. Very good. Now let's go to number four, right? Uh, this is Fatima and Francisco, right? Francisco, you're gonna help me with the question, please. Right? ¿Cuál, ¿Cuál número, profesor? Number four. Number four, okay. Yes, Wendy. I, I, I heard... I heard you read really strange as it was speaking Spanish. <laughs> okay. I'm sorry. No, no, that's okay. Don't worry. Don't worry. Uh, yeah. Even I, I speak Spanish, you know, all the time, but but because you always speak English, so I say. I'm uh, really, I'm really, I'm really sick. I'm feeling. Oh, sorry. Sorry to hear that. You know, last time I was. Last week, last week, right? I was really sick too. Yeah, no. I ate soup. I drank a lot of water. Acetaminophen. Uh, please, Francisco. A, a lot of water, right? But no, you know, no. Okay, good. Excellent. But no crazy water, no, right? Crazy water, no. <laughs> Okay, yeah, that's good. Okay, so what is the question, Francisco? Okay, uh, Wendy, do you want to have dinner with me? No, no, wait, 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 wait. Sorry, Francisco, excuse me, give me a second, sorry. I need to make the question. Remember? What time? Yes, but what time? Do or does? Does. Mm. Restaurants. restaurants is plural, right? Yeah. So, what time? But what time? Restaurant? What time? Okay, wait, wait. What time do or what time does restaurants? Does. Mm. No, no, no. You're right. It's do. Do. Okay, good. What time do restaurants close here? Good, that's it. Right now you're ready. Your letter B. Now, uh, Fatima, your letter A. Come on, go ahead, Fatima. Yes, teacher. Sure. Letter A. Empezamos. Yes. Okay. One, two, three. Wendy, do you want to have dinner with me after the workshop? Microphone, Francisco. No, está, está en mute. Ajá, Fátima. Ya dijo, yo no la escuché, teacher. Ok, Francisco, no la escucharon. Lo los, <risa> los estamos castigando a pesar que anda con gripe, pero ni modo. Again, okay. again. Yes. Yes. But, yes. But, what time do restaurants close here? Oh, around 7.25 p.m. Okay, but Fatima, listen. Remember, you're an actor, right? So you say, oh, oh, around seven, okay. Come on. Oh, around 7.25 p.m. 
p.m. Good. Thank you. Thank you for the effort. Thank you for double effort of Francisco, right? With the flu and working. Yes. And you have to work tonight, Francisco. Yes. Yeah, sorry. Sorry. Working with the flu, right? Good. And now let's go to number five, please. Number five. Uh, Gisela, Hector is now with us. Hector, ya se conectó? Okay, so Gisela and, and Imer, right? Imer, I need, before we start the conversation, you make the question, right? Imer, construyame la pregunta, Imer. And what time does they open? Okay, wait. Do or does? Does. Okay, the subject is they, right? Yes. Do. Do, do or does? Do. Do, right? Remember, does is for he, she, and it. And do is for I, you, we, and they, right? Yeah. Good. So what yes. is the question, Imer? Repeat the question. What um, time? What time do they open? Good. Imer, listen. Time. Time. Mm. Come on. Mm. Mm. Good. Time. Time. Good. That's it, right? Ready? Uh, Gisela? Okay. Amanda, has to take some report to many departments on Monday? And what time, what time do they open? They open around um, 7, 13, or 18, 05. Very good. Thank you. Solo que eh, Imer no tiene cara de Amanda, ¿verdad? Así que le hubiéramos cambiado el nombre de Imer. Imer. Yeah, okay, good. Thank you, thank you. Thank you very much. You see? So, any question? Now we're going to practice the five conversations. Good. Conversation one, please repeat after me. There is a recruitment. There is a recruitment of new employees on Tuesday. There is a recruitment of new employees on Tuesday. Really? What time does it start? What time does it start? It starts at 9 a.m. It starts at 9 a.m. Conversation two, come on. Conversation two. Let's meet for the meeting on Wednesday. Let's meet for the meeting on Wednesday. Great. Great. What time do you arrive? What time do you arrive? I arrive at 8.15. I arrive at 8.15. Conversation three. Tomorrow, tomorrow I have to go to the photocopy center. I have to go to the photocopy center. Tomorrow I have to go to the photocopy center. Me too. What time does the photocopy center open? What time does the photocopy center open? It opens it opens at 6.50 a.m. 
it opens at 6.50 a.m. Conversation four. McDonald's, oh no, sorry, Wendy, do you, do you want to have dinner with me? Do you want to have dinner with me? Do you want to have dinner with me after the workshop? Do you want to have dinner with me after the workshop? Yes. Yes. Don't say yes. No. Yes. But what time do restaurants close here? What time do restaurants close here? What time do restaurants close here? Oh, oh, around 7.25 p.m. Around 7.25 p.m. Okie dokie, so any question, any extra question? Se le olvidó la cinco. Oh, yes, sir. Thank you. Thank you very much. Es lo bueno de que hay mentes brillantes aquí ayudándole a uno, ¿verdad? Porque de repente se le va a uno, se le va a uno el pajarito, como es. <laughs> okay, please, repeat after me. Amanda. Amanda has to take, Amanda has to take some reports Amanda has to take some reports to many departments on Monday. Amanda has to take some reports to many departments on Monday. Amanda has to take some reports to many departments on Monday. And what time do they open? What time do they open? They open around 7.30. They open around 7.30 or 8.05, 8.05. Good. That's it, right? So we're ready to go to the class today. Hoy sí vamos a comenzar temprano la clase. Let me see. What time is it? No, it's very late. Well, let's start, right? So before we continue, I have a question for you. Antes de continuar, uh, ah, Hector is incorporated to the class. Nice, right? Always babysitting, right, Hector? Siempre cuidando a los bebés. Le toca pesadito a Héctor, pero ahí está. Bueno, ya lo vamos a incorporar. Yes, like a babysitter. I know, I know. You, I know what you mean, right? It's too hard. I imagine, I imagine. Especially because they are babies. With, uh, of with, course. With These toddlers. These children are so, yeah, with, so with fire. Toddlers, with toddlers is easier, right? But with babies, oof. We have to be careful. Okay, good. Thank you. Now I have a question. Let's take a, a, a small break, right? Tomemos un pequeño break. So I have this question for you. Listen. Uh, what is similar with uh, an A, the family, and a, an airplane, right? ¿En qué se parece un avión, la familia, y el huevo? Three things, right? Las tres cosas. ¿En qué se parece el avión, la familia y el huevo? Right? Who knows? ¿Alguien sabe la respuesta? Bueno, ahí va la respuesta. ¿En qué se parece el avión, la familia y el huevo? ¿Se parece en qué? En ocasiones, en accidentes, el avión se estrella. ¿Sí? El avión se estrella. Y el huevo, se estrella. 
Ahí está la respuesta, ¿ok? Pero faltó la familia, ¿no? Dijo, pues, ah, familia, ah, avión y... Sorry, y perdón. Pre pregunta, Francisco, disculpe. Usted dijo eh, la familia, el avión ah, y so el make huevo. Make the question, ¿no? please. Make the question. Y la... Yeah. I don't know how do you say... Eh, Francisco, I'm wait. <laughs> wait, Francisco. Ok, so make the question. Hágame la pregunta. ¿Qué faltó? Yes. What about the family, teacher? What about the family? Oh, la familia. Muy bien, gracias. Ok. Now, let's continue, right? <laughs> let's continue. <laughs> Now, let's go to the PPT <laughs> presentation, right? Now, let me see. Good. Es que Francisco cayó, pero no, <laughs> no hacía la pregunta correcta. <laughs> ok. English for Word program, basic module one, right? Today, how to use prepositions of time, tick tock, tick tock, time, right? In, on, and at. Today it's June 9th, 2022, right? Good. Now, what is the objective? Please, Gisela, read the objective for today, please. Okay, I will be able to tell different people the specific time and day of activity I do in my workplace. Okay, very good. The specific time and dates, right? And using the preposition here, right? Okay, now, how to use prepositions of time? Here we have three examples, right? Three examples. We have on, in, and at. When do you use on? On Saturday, on January 23rd, on Monday, on Monday, February the 5th, on Wednesday morning. So listen, you don't say in Saturday, in Saturday. <laughs> in Saturday. No, right? No, no, no. It's on Saturday. Right? Okay. And with the date, con la fecha, fecha, right? On January 23rd, say on, right? Today, for example, right? Today is, look, June 9th, right? So today is, say on June 9th, you see? Or you can include the day, say on Monday, February 5th, on Thursday, June 9th, right? On Wednesday morning, on Thursday afternoon, on Sunday evening, you see? On, 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 on. Now in, in May, in June, in December, we wish you a Merry Christmas. Through all the red nose reindeer, having a shiny nose. So in December, right? In December. In October, right? Etc. etc. Right? Good. Now with the years in 2018, right, Wilfredo? Any question? Yes, teacher. I want to know if the difference between in and on. When we use uh, a month, for example, uh, because I can see in the left part on January 23rd and in the middle part with the preposition in, I can see in May, but we are just using, using the, the month. Hey, listen, Wilfredo, congratulations. You communicate the ideas very good in English. Thank you. Oh, it's complicated, you know, to say it's in the middle, yeah. Good, and I, I totally understand the question. Look, the difference is this. Here, oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. January includes the day, the number of the day in the month, right? Right, right. And here in May, it Just doesn't include uh, only the month. Okay. So when you say the month, And the number of the day, 
Like in this case, on. 23rd, on, right? Okay. But when you say only the month, only the month in, in May, in June, in July, right? Okay, understood, teacher. Yeah, okay, good. Understood. In October, for example, October is the mother's in love burger, right? Eh, cuando se celebra el día, se celebra el día de la suegra, right? October. In October, right? Okay, so you say in, in, right? Okay. Thank Dora Lisa, you, don't laugh. No se ría, Dora Lisa. Es el, la fecha del. Yes. That's a big deal, teacher. It yeah. was funny. <laughs> okay, good. Then the, the seasons in the spring, in the summer, in the autumn, in the winter, right? And parts of the day, in the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening, right? Then when do you use at? With time, at 2.30, at 3, at 4.30, at 9.15, etc., etc., right? And then with some parts of the day, at noon, la hora del sope, you know? At noon, at night, at midnight, right? A la medianoche, right? Okay? So on, in, and at. Please repeat after me. On Saturday, on January 23rd, on Monday, February 5th, on Wednesday morning, in May, in 2018, in the summer, in the morning, at 2.30, at noon, at night, at midnight. Okay, good. Now, we have this, right? It says, when is the meaning? It's in June, in June, you see? When is the meeting with the employees? It's in the morning, in the morning. When's the meeting or when is the meeting with the boss? Con el jefe, jefecito, right? Con el que nos jefe, right? So we say it's in the afternoon. When's the workshop or when is the workshop? It's on June 15th. When is the video call? It's on the 12th. What day is the dinner? Notice that in all the questions we say when, 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 right? So when is a very open question, right? It's una pregunta abierta. So we say the time, when we say la fecha, el día, el año, el mes. Sorry, when we say when, but when we say what day, so the question is directly. What day, right? Que día, right? So in this case, what day is the dinner? It's on Friday. Now, what time, what time, what time's the movie? It's at noon. What time's the game? Select our su granada, right? <laughs> okay, what time's the game? It's at 2.30. It's at 2.30, at 2.30. When's the English class? It's at night, at night, right? Good, so? We're going to do something, right? Um, let me see. Uh, Alexis, you're going to make one, two, three questions, Alexis. And uh, Oscar is going to answer the three questions, right? Ready? OK, one, two, three. When's the meeting? Oscar? 
It is in John. Alexis. Uh, wait. It is in the morning. No, no, wait. When's the meeting? Alexis, when's the meeting? When's the meeting? Wait. Or wait. With. 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 The employees. Oscar? It is in the morning. When the meeting with the boss. It is in the afternoon. Good. Thank you very much. Now, yeah. uh, Rebecca, you make the next three questions. And Wilfredo, you answer the question, right? Workshop, video call, and dinner, right? Right. When's the workshop? It's on June 15. When's the video call? It's on the 12th. What day is the dinner? It's on Friday. Thank you very much. Uh, Sylvia, you made the, the last three questions. Movie, game, English class. And Candy, you answer the question, right? <clears throat> okay. When when the meeting? Ah, uh -huh, Wilfredo. Mm. The meeting. She said the meeting. Ah, the meeting. No, 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 no. It's the movie. The okay. movie. What time the movie? Ah, no, no, no. Wait, wait a minute. Sorry. Ya, ya me perdí. Excuse me. <laughs> I was asking Silvia and Candy, right? Sí. Right. Yes, sir. Or Rebecca or Wilfredo. Sorry. Perdón, ya. Me subiqué porque estaba leyendo un mensaje del grupo. We were in the previous one. Okay, good. So in this case is Silvia and Candy, right? Estamos? Yeah. Okay, sorry. Excuse me. Desde el principio. Veloso. Okay. So, Silvia, <clears throat> movie, game, and English class, Silvia. Come on. What time's the movie? Candy? It's at noon. Continue. continue. Okay, please continue. Continue. Three questions. Okay. What time the game? It has to 30. Uh, when the English class? It's at night. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you very much. You see? So in June, in the morning, in the afternoon, on June 15th, on the 12th, like you say, ah, it's el 12, it's el 12 de, de junio, you know? El 12. So that, that, that way you say the 12th, right? Now, on Friday at noon at 2.30 at night, right? Good. Let's continue. Now, we're going to learn when to use on, when to use in, and when to use at. Pay attention, please. Use on with names of days, including part, right? Nombres de días y algunas partes que van a la parte de su nombre, ¿sí? And dates, fechas, fechas, right? So we can say on Thursday, on Friday, on Sunday, etc., etc., on, right? Then you can say on Monday morning, on Saturday afternoon, on what, Wednesday evening, on Friday morning, etc., etc., right? Some dates. Uh-huh, Eric. Um, sorry, teacher. Um, and use in which period is a uh, falta D? Some periods of time. Yeah, it's a uh, period. Period of time, yes. Eh, con period de tiempo, right? No, no haría la falta letra D. Ok. Periods. 
Uh, on, usted dice on the Thursday. No. No, no sé si, no, no, perdón, en, no, no le entiendo la pregunta, disculpe. ¿Cómo, cómo es? En la palabra perios, no era peri de ese. Period of time. Eh, eh, ah, ya, 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 ya le caché, sí. Otro error de escritura, sí, vamos a corregirlo, permítanme. Sí, ya le, ya le comprendí la, la observación, sí. Aquí está, period. Periods of time, ¿verdad? Ok, vamos a guardarlo y regresamos, sí. Thank you, ya, ahora sí ya lo entendí. Si hay otro rosito por ahí, me dicen, ¿verdad? que a veces me pongo a escribir y, y se me va un, una letra, ¿ok? Good, so let's continue. So we say, uh, on Monday morning, you see, o on Father's Day, you know, el día más importante del año, ¿sí? On Father's Day. Oh, please, I'm serious. Estoy hablando en serio. Please. No lo tomemos a broma, es en serio. You're really funny. Si no, pregúntenle a Héctor, que está ahí con la clase y con los bebés a la, a la misma vez, ¿verdad? Like a babysitter. Yes, you, 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 you deserve a big gift this coming Friday. Hector, because you're a great father, right? Okay, so on Father's Day, on Mother's Day, on Saint, let, let's say on, how do you say, Día del Amor, uh, San Valentine's Day, right? on San Valentine's Day, right? So you say on, right? On July 2nd, on the weekend, on Saturdays, on a weekday, you know? Aquí no está, pero también on vacation. Para decir vacación también se usa on, right? On vacation. ¿Qué me faltó? So, you see, on. Use in with periods of time, right? But no with names of days. Sin, sin los días. De ahí todos los demás. In, right? En años, en meses, en horas, en... en um, ¿Cómo se dice? En... En seasons, en español season, en... How do you say seasons in Spanish? En... en temporada. Estaciones, estaciones. 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 Ah, de la estación. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> es que a veces la laguna mental, eh, eh, seasons, me acordaba la canción de la palabra en inglés, pero no en español. Las estaciones, yes? So when you say las estaciones, in the winter, in the summer, in the spring, in the... Season. Autumn. Adiós. Adiós. Ok, in, in the wind. Right? The season. The season, yes, the seasons. The season, right? The four seasons. Hay un grupo que así se llama también de los 70. The four seasons. Ok, the winter, the, the spring, the summer, and the autumn, right? So you say in. Nunca me van a decir on, on the summer. <laughs> on the summer, no. In the summer. In the winter, right? In an hour. Right? Or you can say in three minutes, in four hours, in three hours, you know, in, right? In the evening, in the morning, in the afternoon, right? With centuries, con siglos también se usa, miren, in the 21st century, right? In the 20th century, right? Hay una productora de películas que se llama El Zorro del Siglo XX, ¿verdad? The 20th century fox presents, right? Okay, so in the 20th, siglo XX, right? The, the 20th century. Y este siglo que estamos ahora, 21st. Lamento decirles que el siglo XXII ya quizás no hemos alcanzado a verlo, no. Pero sería in the 22nd century, right? Nuestros nietos van a tal vez estar por ahí en ese siglo, right? Okay, in the 80s. Los 80, in the 70s, la época del disco, ¿verdad? Uh, uh, uh. Ok. So, in the 90s, en los 90 ¿sí? Yeah? In two weeks, in two months, in three hours, in two years, ¿verdad? Etcétera, etcétera, etcétera. In, right? Then, at. At is more specific. Listen, specific. Very specific, right? 
So when we say that, we say at nine, at 10, at 9.30, right? At sunrise, al salir el sol, right? Sunrise. At down, en la madrugada, no? al amanecer, down. At sunset, la puesta del sol, ¿verdad? At sunset. At noon, at midnight, right? Good. Any question? Aquí solo es cuestión de memorizar, siento yo, ¿verdad? Tienen que memorizar cuando se usa in, cuando se usa on, cuando se usa at, ¿ok? ¿Qué significa midnight, teacher? Midnight. Midnight. Mid. Mid quiere decir media. Media. Oh. Night es noche, media noche. Media. Ah, ok. Mid. La hora de los espantos, ¿verdad? Mm. Sí. A ver quién se atreve a pasar a medianoche en un cementerio. ¿eh? Ok, mid. No, mentira, ahora ya no, ya no es a la medianoche, sino que a las 3 de la madrugada. A las 3. Ah, bueno. ¿Se atrevería usted, José Antonio? ¿Se atrevería? Podría ser que sí, con alguien, con acompañantes. Ah, sí. no, hombre, así quién no. Pero, Solito, pero digo solo. yo. Solo. <risa> así sí, no. No, una vez con unos amigos nos quedó el carro ahí en medio del de cementerio de los ilustres. ¿Verdad? Y ahí a medianoche nos quedamos por ahí una vez, pero menos mal que andamos acompañados. ¿Qué andaban ¿Qué? haciendo por ahí a medianoche? Ah, fregando, cuando era joven. <risa> no le puedo dar detalles, José Antonio, no le puedo dar detalles. <risa> ok, good. So, any question? Questions? No, ok. So, we're going to play a game. Vamos a jugar un juego. True and false. True and false. A solista, teacher. Sorry? A solista. Solista? Sí, ah, nine o'clock. What time is it? Sorry. Oh, yes. No, no yet. Thank nine you. Twelve. Thank you. Please. Uh, Silvia? Present, teacher. Candy? Present, teacher. Carmen? Hi, teacher. Doralicia? Present, teacher. Eric? Present. Esmeralda? Esmeralda, Fátima, Hello, teacher. Francisco, I'm flu, but I'm here. Good, I know, I know. Gisela, present teacher. Hector, Hector, here. Good, thank you. Imer, present. Irving, Irving. Qué raro que me ha contactado Irving. Okay. Eh, José Antonio. Good evening, teacher. Roberto. Present, teacher. Margarita. Present, teacher. María. Present. Alexis. Present. Alexis. Present. Oscar. Present. Rebeca. Present. Wilfredo. Present. Good, that's it, right? Emeralda? Present yeah. teacher. Okay, good, thank you. That's it, we have full house today, right? Solo Irving, no hizo falta. Okay, good. So uh, we're going to play again, right? I will uh, tell your name, and then I'm gonna tell you, true or false, true or false, right? Verdadero or false, verdadero or false, okay? For the correct answer, I will make. And for the incorrect answer, I will make and okay. Good. Let's start with Wilfredo. Listen, Wilfredo. On 2022. On 2022. True or false? False. False, right? Because it's in, right? Good. Uh, Silvia. Ready, Silvia? Yes, teacher. At nine o'clock. At nine. True. Good. Candy. Yes. Teacher. In Mother's Day. In Mother's Day. Incorrect. False. False. 
polls, right? Good. Eh, Rebeca. In Hi. noon. In noon. True or false? In noon. False. Sorry? True or false? False. False. It's yeah. rain. Ah, no, right? Good, thank you. Uh, Doralicia. On 2021. On 2021. On 2021. True or false? True or false? False. False. Congratulations. Very good, Dora Alicia. Uh, Oscar. Sí. On December. On December. False. False. Sí. Very good. Okay. Eric. Uh, in the weekend. In the weekend. True uh, or false, true. Eric? True. Oh, sorry. Mm. Hey, sorry, it's false. Ah, false. Okay, good. Okay. Thank you. Now, please, Alexis. In three weeks. In three weeks, Alexis. True. True. Esmeralda. Esmeralda, in Friday, in Friday. False. False. Very good. Uh, Fatima, in December 24th, in December 24th. True. 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 Huh? Sorry. True. In December 24th, Fatima? Wow. False. Wow. No. <laughs> wait, Fatima, wait. No. Like, true or false, Fatima? True false. or false? False. False, okay. Very good, okay. <laughs> Me pareció un trabalengua. Por cierto, vamos a... Les voy a enseñar un trabalengua para que practiquemos, ¿verdad? <laughs> Si no escucho, teacher, porque ah, viento. ah, bueno, el viento, ¿verdad? Sí. Ok, pero no ha caído la lluvia todavía ahí, Fátima. Sí, está lloviendo ahorita. Ah, bueno, It's bueno. raining, teacher. In, in, your, in your house too, Héctor. Of course. It's oh, raining cat and dog. Because here in Mexicanos is not. Mexicanos is free. Ok, let's continue, right? Uh, let me see, Francisco, in a week, in a week. It's correct. True or false? True. Very good. Uh, Maria, on the evening, on the evening. Okay. Is false. Correct. Gisela. Uh, in the summer. In the summer. False. True or false? False. In the summer. In the mm. summer. True. True. Okay. Very good. No es que les esté ayudando, no solo un pausa ahí para que piensen. Ok, good. So, let me see. Eh, Héctor. Yes. In sunrise. In sunrise. True or false? In sunrise. True. In sunrise. True or false? Could be false. False, yeah, very good, thank you. 
because at sunrise is correct, right? Okay, and let me see, Imer, in 10 o'clock, in 10 o'clock. False. False. Good. And to finish, uh, Jose Antonio, right? Jose Antonio, in, in Sundays, in Sundays. False. False. Correct, right? Good. With this information, let's work. Vamos a trabajar, right? So number one, please, volunteers, number one. Oops, sorry, excuse me. Vamos a hacerlo más grande acá. Ah, okay, there we go, here we are. So volunteers for number one, please. Uh, let me see, yes. The party is in, on, or at. Volunteers, please. At. Uh, Gisela, please, at. Gisela. Le oigo, le, le oigo algo raro la voz, Gisela. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding, right? So, estoy bromeando, pero. Okay, the party is? At 8 p.m. At 8 p.m., very good. So, next one, right? Creo que Héctor quería participar ahí. Okay, Héctor, the dinner is? Y luego María. Héctor, the dinner is? On Monday. On Monday, good. María. On Monday? Um, on Monday at six o'clock. At six o'clock, very good. Next one, please. The concert is at noon. Oh, sorry, no veo, no veo manitas levantadas. No sé. Sorry. The concert is at at noon. At noon. Bueno. Creo que es Silvia la que está contestando, ¿verdad? Sí. Levante las manitas para ver sus nombres. Por... Ah. Ok, José Antonio. At noon, José Antonio. On Sunday. On Sunday. Very good. Y ahí de otra manita. Francisco, please. The movie is... On Friday and Saturday. Can I go to the bathroom yet? Go, 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 no problem. Drink a lot of water. <laughs> Very good. So the meaning is okay. Wait a minute. Sorry, class. Let's 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 put a little order here, right? So remember, you have to raise your hand. Cuando ustedes levantan su manita, aquí veo sus nombres. Lo que pasa que como no los tengo en pantalla en pantalla todos no no veo ahí quién me quiere comentar. Entonces siempre levantemos la manita, okay? The meeting is volunteers. Oh yes, Fatima. At three. Okay. Yeah. Number six. Silvia. Uh, English class is on Tuesday. On Tuesday. On Tuesday at two thirty. Two thirty. Very good. Next one, the train, the train. The train is at Rebecca. Rebecca, yes, okay. It's at. Ah, okay, very good. Thank you. <clears throat> and the last one, please, the game is Volunteers? On uh, Wednesday. On. On. Eh, Wednesday. Bueno, escucho dos voces ahí, pero vamos a ponerlo aquí. On. Los do, las dos voces dijeron on, ¿verdad? Okay. That's it. Now let's go to the next one. This is question and answer. Question and answer, right? So for number one, I need two volunteers. Two volunteers. Dos voluntarios. Ok, eh, ahora sí déjenme ver correr la cámara para ver, ah, aquí estamos. Eh, Silvia en José Antonio, please. José Antonio, you are A, Silvia, you are B. Uh, 
What time the game? It <laughs> at noon. Okay, so Jose Antonio, what time is or what only what time? <coughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Uh huh. Jose Antonio. Ah. Falta algo aquí entre time y, y what, sí o no? What time? What time the game? Ah, pero falta algo, Jose Antonio, sí o no? Sí. On the game. Mm. No. ¿Qué me le ha ido a José Antonio? ¿Qué falta what time is? is the game? It is. is. Right. What, what time, time is. is the game? What time? Ah, que al revés, perdón. What time <laughs> is. Qué oso. Vaya, vamos. <laughs> perdón. Eh, vamos a poner apóstrofe mejor para que. Contra el caos, ¿sí? What time what is? Times. Or you can say what time is the game, right? Yes. Okay, at noon. Now, two volunteers for number two. Two volunteers for number two. Two volunteers for number two. Yes. Yes. Hector, and? Can me ayuda, Hector? Fatima, please. Okay, Hector, letter A. Okay, when's the party? When's the party? Ahí está ya la, la apóstrofe, ¿ya? ¿eh? Okay, when's the party? Good. And Fátima? Fátima. It's on Friday at 8 o'clock. Good, thank you. Two more volunteers, please. Silvia. Silvia, number three, right? ¿Quién me le ayuda, yeah. Silvia, con la letra B? Um, what time? Uh, Gisela. Gisela, ¿sí? Bye. Si me confundo, discúlpeme, pero lo que veo en la pantalla es aquí. Okay. Silvia en Gisela. Come on. Ok. What time? Is the, is the dinner? It's on Tuesday. Good. Number four, please. One time. Ajá, uh -huh. eh, Margarita. Permítame, ya le voy al compañero, Margarita. ¿Qué me le da Margarita okay. con la letra B? Letter B. Ah, ok, Silvia. One time. I eat at six. Uh, four, 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 five. Forty. Forty-five. Forty-five, yes. Okay, good. And number five, please. Number five. Gisela, again. Very good. Gisela. ¿Quién me le ayuda, Gisela? Yes, teacher. Yo le ayudo. Eh, Doralicia. Candy. No. Candy. Candy. Okay, Candy. Good. So, Gisela, letter A. What day is the movie? What day it, it is the movie? It's on Saturday. Candy, su voz se parece un poco al de Doralicia también. No sé si es mi, mi imaginación. Sí, podría ser. Pues. Sí, ¿verdad? It's on Saturday. On Saturday. ¿Sunday o Saturday, Candy? Saturday. Saturday, muy bien. Porque así se los chambres, ¿va? Es Sunday. Es Sunday, es Saturday, right? Estamos bromeando, estamos bromeando. Ok, number six, please. Yes, Number six. Uh, yes, eh, Fátima and Rebecca, please. Ah, uh, Fátima. Fátima. Creo que le está fallando ahí el internet a Fátima, ¿verdad? Entonces, eh, Fátima. No, ok. Eh, Rebeca me había levantado la mano, ¿verdad? Vale, yes. José, José Antonio y Rebeca. José Antonio y Rebeca. 
Ok, José Antonio, what? What time is it? What time is it? Right, Rebecca? At. Mm. It's at. It's. It's, right? It's 4.46, right? Ok, aquí como que cambia un poco la dinámica, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. So repeat after me. Eh, creo que a Fátima se le fue el internet. Eh, aquí también ya empezó a llover en mexicanos. Así que por cualquier cosa, me desaparezco, me esperan, por favor. <laughs> ok. No, repeat after me, please. What time's the game? What time's the game? It's at noon. When's the party? It's on Friday at 8. It's on Friday at 8. What time is the dinner? It's on Tuesday. What time is the train? It's at 8. No, sorry. It's at 6.45. It's at 6.45. What day is the movie? It's on Saturday. What time is, sorry, what time is it? What time is it? It's 4.46 now. Good, so we finish. I don't know if you have any question. Hay alguna preguntita sobre el uso del in, on, and at, José Antonio? No, 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 solamente estaba con la duda que usted dijo que en, en... PowerPoint iba a ser el ejercicio del, del libro. Ah, no, no, no. No, es que no me deja. Ah, sí, ya, ya me acordé, la, la hora, ¿verdad? Sí, aquí vamos a... Permita, vamos a, a borrar un poquito esto. Si es que quedé pendiente ahí con Margarita, que no... Porque no solamente abre una nueva página. Psst, excelente, tiene razón. Perdón, mi... <ríe> Es que a veces uno va por lo más, más difícil, va. Bueno, vamos a borrar esta. No me deja, mire, José Antonio. Ahí estamos. Y es que aquí me quedan un montón de voladitos. Vamos a eliminarlo. Pues. Ya me hice bolas aquí. Por aquí, por aquí vamos a, Aquí en esta vamos a escribir. Ahí, ahí, ahí. Va, Margarita, este sí lo ve, Margarita. Sí. Sí, va, muy bien. Entonces decíamos que para escribir las 8 y 30, hey, Terry. Permítame. Vamos a ser más grande. Um, vamos a hacer a 50. Ahí está. Ok, 8 So we say it's it's 8 it's 8 30, right? It's 8.30. Or, este es un ejercicio que vamos a hacer mañana también. ¿Cómo decir el tiempo en dos formas? It's half past eight, right? Okay, so it's 8.30 or it's half past eight. Ahora, cuando nos referimos a una reunión, a una videollamada, a una fiesta, a un, a un cumpleaños, etcétera, etcétera, y preguntamos, what time is, por ejemplo, what time is the party? What time is, y aquí usamos la preposición at, miren. It's, it's at 8.30. O is at 
at half past eight, right? Okay? Cuando nos están preguntando de un evento, ¿sí? Pero cuando solo decimos la hora, pues no es necesario decir at. Okay, good. Margarita, ¿estamos claros? Sí, yes. sí, sí, muy bien. Esta parte es un poco complicada. ¿Cómo decir las ocho y media, las nueve y media, las doce y media, etcétera, etcétera? Eh, half quiere decir la mitad. Ha pasado a las ocho, la mitad. Quiere decir que son treinta minutos, ¿sí? Ok, ¿good? Any question? ¿Hay alguna otra pregunta? Hasta ahí, ¿verdad? No, no, no deja así. Ok. Vamos entonces al manual. Déjame ver. Pero antes de ir al manual, tengo un ejercicio especial para ustedes, ¿sí? Dime a second. Okay. So this is the exercise, right? Vamos a agrandarlo un poquitito. Ahí está. Permítame un segundito. Aquí estamos. Yes. Teacher, no Good. se le ve la cara. Inglés corporativo aparece. Ah, ¿no, ¿No se ve? A usted no se le ve el rostro. Ah, bueno, permítame. ¿Hoy sí? ¿Me veo? Hello. Hoy sí. Yes, ok. <risa> Perdone que <risa> hay mucha tecnología todavía que me cuesta. Permítame. Ok, quitamos esto de aquí. Hacemos esto para allá. Sí, yes. Ok, listen. Uh, around the world. Por ahí me decían algunos de ustedes que les costaba este ejercicio, ¿verdad? De escuchar. Pues vamos a escucharlo varias veces para que les ayude, ¿sí? Ok. So, it's 9 a.m. in Los Angeles, California, right? Vanessa is calling friends around the world. Vanessa es una chica que tiene amigos por todo el mundo, ¿verdad? So, we're going to listen to the conversation and complete the chat. For example, eh, we say, Sara. Manuel and Bob. So, Vanessa is calling Sara, Vanessa is calling Manuel, and Vanessa is calling Bob, right? So, number one, you're going to tell me the city, the time, and the activity they are doing, right? City, time, and the activity. So, listen, please. Units five to six progress check. Page 42, exercise one, listening. Around the world. It's 9 a.m. in Los Angeles. Vanessa is calling friends around the world. Listen to the conversations and complete the chart. One. Hello? Hello, Sarah? This is Vanessa. I'm calling from Los Angeles. Hi, Vanessa. How are you? I'm good. So, how are things in New York? Oh, fine, thanks. What time is it there? It's about 12 o'clock. It's noon? Oh, I'm sorry. Are you having lunch now? No, no, it's okay. I'm just watching television. Two. Hello, Manuel. This is Vanessa in Los Angeles. How are you? I'm not sure, Vanessa. It's a little early for me. Really? What time is it in Mexico City? Well, it's a quarter after 11 in the morning here. 11.15 a.m.? Yeah. I'm having breakfast right now. You're having breakfast? Yeah. I always get up late on Saturdays. Hello. Hello. Is this Bob? Yes, it is. This calling, please. 
this is Vanessa. Oh, hi, Vanessa. So, Bob, how are things in Sydney? Things are fine, but you know it's 3.30 in the morning here? Oh, I'm sorry. It's okay. I'm not sleeping. What are you doing? I'm reading a really great book. It's about to start. Good. Second time. Unit five is around the world. It's 9 a.m. in Los Angeles. Vanessa is calling friends around the world. Listen to the conversations and complete the chart. One. Hello? Hello, Sarah? This is Vanessa. I'm calling from Los Angeles. Hi, Vanessa. How are you? I'm good. So, how are things in New York? Oh, fine, thanks. What time is it there? It's about 12 o'clock. It's noon? Oh, I'm sorry. Are you having lunch now? No, no, it's okay. I'm just watching television. Two. Hello, Manuel. This is Vanessa in Los Angeles. How are you? I'm not sure, Vanessa. It's a little early for me. Really? What time is it in Mexico City? Well, it's a quarter after 11 in the morning here. 11.15 a.m.? Yeah. I'm having breakfast right now. You're having breakfast? Yeah. I always get up late on Saturdays. Hello. Hello. Is this Bob? Yes, it is. Just call me, please. This is Vanessa. Oh, hi, Vanessa. So, Bob, how are things in Sydney? Things are fine, but you know it's three thirty in the morning here. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, I'm not sleeping. What are you doing? I'm reading a really great book. It's about to start. Okay, now we're going to go one by one, right? Let's just start with Sara, and then we already have the city, New York, right? Then you're going to tell me the time, right? The time and the, the activity. Vanessa is calling friends around the world. Listen to the conversations and complete the chart. One. Hello? Hello, Sarah? This is Vanessa. I'm calling from Los Angeles. Hi, Vanessa. How are you? I'm good. So, how are things in New York? Oh, fine, thanks. What time is it there? It's about 12 o'clock. It's noon. Good. So what time is in New York? 12 o'clock. 12 o'clock. Or you can say it's noon, right? It's noon. Now, what is Sarah doing? What is the activity? Listen, please. Oh, I'm sorry. Are you having lunch now? No, no, it's okay. I'm just watching television. Okay, what is the activity? Uh, watching television. Watch television. Watch television, right? Good. So, New York or New York, if you want to say, time is noon and the activity is watch television, right? Good. Let's go to Manuel Memo, right? Let's see what happened with Memo. Pay attention, please. Hello, Manuel. This is Vanessa in Los Angeles. How are you? I'm not sure, Vanessa. It's a little early for me. Really? What time is it in Mexico City? Well, it's a quarter after 11 in the morning here. 
eleven fifteen a.m. Yeah. Good. So please, the city. What city is it? Mexico. 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 Orale, Mexico. Right. And what time is it? Eleven fifteen a.m. Eleven fifteen p.m. Eleven fifteen or eleven fifty. Eleven fifteen. Eleven fifteen. Let's uh, listen again. Because yeah. You're, you're a quarter. A quarter minute past eleven, teacher. Mm -hmm. Okay. Listen again. No. I'm not sure, Vanessa. It's a little early for me. Really? What time is it in Mexico City? Well, it's a quarter after eleven in the morning here. Eleven fifteen a.m. Uh huh. Again. Fifteen. 11 15 am 11:15 right 15 15 no 15 like calcetin cafetin 15 right okay 11:15 that's okay and what is the activity manuel is doing what is manuel doing listen yeah i'm having breakfast right now you're having breakfast yeah i always get up late on saturdays so what is Manuel doing? Having breakfast. Have breakfast, right? Have breakfast. That's it. Let's go to ball. Let's go to ball. The city, the time, and the activity. Wait. Hello. Hello. Is this Bob? Yes, it is. Just call me, please. This is Vanessa. Oh, hi, Vanessa. So, Bob, how are things in Sydney? Things are fine, but you know it's 3.30 hey. in the morning here? Oh, I'm sorry. It's okay. Good. So what is the city? Sydney. Sydney. Sorry? Sydney. Sydney. Sydney, right? Remember finding Nemo, buscando Nemo? <laughs> So that's the city, Sydney. Sydney is the capital of Australia, yes or no? No. no. Sydney is the capital of Australia, yes si or no? No. No. No, right? Canberra is the capital of Australia, right? Sydney is just an important city. So, okay, good. And what time is it in Sydney? What time is it, is it in Sydney, please? I don't know. 3.30. 3.30. Okay, listen again. Listen again. Is this Bob? Yes, it is. Just call me, please. This is Vanessa. Oh, hi, Vanessa. So, Bob, how are things in Sydney? Things are fine. But, you know, it's 3.30 in the morning, dear. Oh, I'm sorry. What time? No, te entiende, teacher. No. 3.30. It's 3.40. Okay. Sorry, to check it here for people. Again. Three and a half. Wait. <laughs> so, Bob, how are things in Sydney? Things are fine, but you know it's 3.30 in the morning here. Oh, I'm sorry. Good. So what time is it? 3.30. 3.30 or half past three. Half past three or 3.30, right? Okay. And what is Bob doing? Okay. I'm not sleeping. What are you doing? I'm reading a really great book. It's not the sky. So what is Bob doing? The book. Read a book. Okay? He's reading a book, right? Good. Sorry for the sound, right? Perdón por el sonido, pero uh, recuérdense en una, tele, en una conversación telefónica es mucho más difícil entender, ¿verdad? Que estando en vivo con las personas. Así que Por eso cuesta un poquitito. Vamos a ver si es cierto. Aquí está la respuesta, miren. 
No. Sara, New York, 12 noon, watching television, right? Watch television. Manuel, Mexico City, 11.15, having breakfast. And Bob in Sydney, 3.30 a.m. in the morning, you know, and reading a book, right? Okie dokie, good. So let's finish the class with the manual, right? En lo que les ubico el manual, vamos a ver. Uh, <clears throat> María, please help me, María. Okay. Eh, antes de compartirles el manual, María, uh, ¿puede repetirme esta oración? Repeat, please. El narizón okay. de la narizonería. El narizón de la narizonería. ¿Ah? Repeat, please. <laughs> El narizón de la narizonería. Okay, you're good, right? Pajarito te narizonaré. Eh, repíteme. Pajarito te narizonaré. Pajarito te narizonaré. Oh, good, you're good. Excellent. María, the last one, please. Pajarito te descorazonaré. Pajarito te descorazonaré. Okay, excellent, very good. Now let's go and share, please, the manual, right? The manual. And we're going to go to page number 35, right? Page 35. Good. Here, I will choose three students from the class, right? Three, three students from the class, and they are going to help me, right? Good, let me see. At random, at random, al azar, vamos a ver. Three victims, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, three students, I mean. And el sortudo, sortuda es Jose Antonio. Okay, Jose Antonio, pay attention, please. I need you tell me, Jose Antonio, three activities that you are planning to do this week. Right? Tres actividades que usted planea hacer durante esta semana. Bueno, eso lo queda viernes, but, pero me imagino que trabajan sábado, ¿verdad, José Antonio? Entonces, ¿qué actividades piensa sí. hacer para mañana y el sábado? Sí. ¿sí? Vale, escríbamelo en el cuaderno. En lo que yo escojo otro, sorry, otro estudiante. Ok. Let me see. Eric Armando Flores Linares. Mr. Flores, are you ready? Yeah. Okay, now I need you to write three activities. Tres actividades que piensa hacer el día de mañana o el sábado. Imagino que usted trabaja también el sábado, ¿verdad? Okay? Three okay. activities. No. No, no, entonces solo viernes. ¿Qué piensa hacer mañana entonces? Yes? Yeah. Okay, good. And here the date is... Friday, right? Friday. Okay. And number okay. three. En lo que escribe José. Y Eric, right? Sí. Eso con el siguiente alumno. Roberto. Hello, Roberto. Yes. Oh, Robert, okay. Dígame tres actividades, Roberto, que usted vaya a hacer el día de mañana. Tres actividades, ¿verdad? Sí. Piénselo bien. Y ahora vamos con José Antonio, ¿ok? Good. Dígame una actividad, José Antonio, que piensa hacer mañana. Y you can say in English, say in Primero, Spanish. chequear mi carro. Si no puede decirlo en inglés, pues dígame. Well, um, check my car. Sorry, repeat. Check my car. Check your car. Okay. Check my car. My car. One. Check my car. Good. Now wait. Wait. Now, let me see. Sylvia, ask this question. What time do you check your car? What time do you check your car? Or, le voy a dar esta opción, Sylvia. When do you check your car? Entonces, en este caso, Antonio le va, tiene dos opciones. Le va a decir el día y la hora en que empieza él revisar su carro, ¿ok? 
Okay. okay. Please, Silvia, ready with the with the question? Um, <clears throat> when when to the check a car? Your car. Your car. Your car. Good. Uh huh, Jose Antonio. I check my car. Um, and check my car Saturday. Um, oh, wait, wait, wait. In, on or at? On Saturday. Uh huh. On Saturday. At four p.m. At four p.m. Very good. Excellent. Also, right? Okay. Good. Next activity, Jose Antonio. Next activity. Sería separar las patas de una góndola. Okay, to separate one piece, digámoslo, hagámoslo algo sencillo, porque generalmente, pues nosotros no sabemos bien de, bueno, ni no sé cómo se dice góndola en inglés, pero ya le voy a averiguar. Pero... <risa> separate, separate a piece, póngale. separate a piece, separar una pieza. Digamos que no sabemos qué es la pieza, ¿verdad? Entonces, repeat, please, separate. What's that separate. Talking? separate? Separate. A piece. A piece. Okay, una pieza, una parte, a part. A, what is it, a part or a piece? Good. Now, uh, Wilfredo, make the question. Wilfredo. Okay, Jose Antonio, when do you separate that piece? Mm. I separate. What? I separate. I separate the piece. The piece. Um. Friday. Um. Night. Pm. Good, excellent, very good. Ya casi nos queda tiempo, así que solo vamos a hacer una actividad para Eric y otra actividad para, para quién era el otro, perdón. Qué mala memoria tengo, ¿verdad? Eric y quién más era? Roberto. Bueno, vamos con Eric. Eric, please. What do you plan to do tomorrow, Eric? Um, I go to the gym. Go Maybe. to the gym. Go to the gym. Yeah. Very good. Thank you. Ah, Roberto era el otro, ya me acordé. Eh, Oscar, pregúntemele a Eric. ¿Qué hora piensa ir al, al gym? ¿verdad? Vamos. Um, when to the go uh, gym? To the gym. To the gym. To the gym. Ajá, uh -huh, Eric. Um, at five o'clock. At five o'clock. A.M. o P.M., Eric? P.M. Ok, very good. Okay. A Roberto, please. Una actividad que piensa hacer mañana, eh, Roberto. Mm, mañana reunión. Meeting. Con los jefes. Okay. Have a meeting, meeting with? Have a meeting. With my? With my? ¿Cómo decimos jefe, Roberto? Boss. 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 Ok, repeat, please. Have a meeting. Have a meeting with me. My boss. My boss. My boss. Good. Thank you. And now, uh, Alexis, make the question to Roberto, please. Alexis? Okay. Maria, ayúdeme, Maria, help me. Okay. Mm, please. Eh, no, no escuché, teacher, se corta. Uh, no me escucho a mí. No. No, no, vaya. Um, me le va a preguntar a Roberto a qué hora va a tener su reunión con el, con el jefe, ¿sí? Ah, okay. Uh, what time do you have a meeting? 
with your with your with your boss. Hola. With your boss. With your boss. Me copia, María. Hola. María, María, me copia, María. <laughs> Hola, me quedé el sin internet. What, el 20, el 20, what time do you have a meeting with your boss? Ajá, Roberto. At 9 o'clock a.m. At 9 o'clock a.m. Very good. Y como siempre, dejamos tarea, ¿verdad? Ok, eh, aquí tengo un ejercicio. Por favor, me lo terminan y mañana lo vamos a chequear, ¿sí? Entonces vamos a, la, a pasar listado. Eh, el que vaya mencionando, pues puede retirarse y me quedaría con... Uh, con María, ¿verdad? No, perdón. Sí, María. A usted le había dicho, ¿verdad, María? María sí, me... sí. Sí, sí, vale. Entonces se me queda 10 minutos más, María. Y okay. Roberto, Roberto mañana sería, ¿verdad? Ok, ahí estamos. Yes. Ok, Liz, attendance list, listado de asistencia. Uh, Ana, sorry, Silvia. Silvia. Present, present teacher. Ok, good, thank you. Candy. Present teacher. Thank you, Carmen. Present teacher. Good, have a good night. Dora Alicia. <laughs> Good night. Good night, Dora Alicia. God bless you. Eric. Uh, good night. Good night, Esmeralda. Good night, teacher. Good night, Fátima. Good night. Miss Cubías, Arias. Fátima, Fátima. Okay. Uh, Francisco. Good night, teacher. Good, Good bless night. God bless you. Get better. Get better. Take care. A lot of liquids <laughs> and lemon too. Please, lemonade yeah. is very good, right? Gisela. Good night, teacher. Good night. Good night. God bless you. Thank you, Hector. Here I am. Okay. Good night. God bless the you. Best, the best babysitter. <laughs> okay. Bye bye. The best one and the only one. Yeah, the only one. <laughs> okay. Imer. Good night, teacher. Good night. God bless you. Uh, Irving. Okay. Jose Antonio. Good night, teacher. Good night. Roberto. Good night, teacher. Good night. Margarita. Good night, teacher. Have a good night, Margarita. Maria. Present. Good. Alexis. Alexis. You say impressive. Okay. Oscar. Present teacher. Good. Good Rebecca. night. Present. Good, Good night teacher. Good night. Wilfredo. Good night. Good night, Wilfredo. God bless you. See you tomorrow. Uh, por aquí tengo algunos mensajes. Um, Fátima, sí, ya, ya le tomé la asistencia, Fátima. Y Alexis, ya están tomadas las existentes. Sí, sin problema, no se preocupe. Ok, sí. nos quedamos con... Sí. Fátima, ya le tomé la asistencia, oigan. No tenga pena. Y María, ¿qué se me hizo María? Aquí estoy, teacher. Ah, va, está bien. No me voy a retirar. No. Permítalo, solo déjeme cerrar aquí. Un montón de ventanas que tengo aquí, sí. Vaya, ok. Ahí estamos, María. Eh, ¿Le está fallando la cámara, María? Eh, no. Okay. <laughs> Aquí estoy. Ah, ok. Excelente. How are you, María? Fine, teacher. Fine. Very pues fine. Siempre, siempre feliz, ¿verdad, María? Yes. <laughs> I'm trying to be happy, everything. Yeah, nice. I like, I like that attitude because we have a lot of problems. Tenemos muchos, muchos problemas, ¿verdad? Todos. Pero con la actitud es importante, ¿sí? Ok, yes. ¿Qué, le han, ¿qué le han parecido las clases, María? Ah, pues a mí me han gustado mucho. Fíjese que yo, yo he tomado otros cursos de inglés. Ah, ¿en virtual o presencial, María? Esta es la primera vez que he sido virtual. Uh -huh. Es diferente, pero, va, sí. Es diferente, pero fíjese que eh, he podido entender mucho más 
Sí, Porque sí. por lo menos la regla, siento que la forma en que usted las explica ha sido como más, más fácil comprenderlas. ¿Ya se no fue como... la regla entonces? ¿Hola? ¿Se puede la regla? Es una así larguita, larguita con varios números. Sí, ajá. En milímetros, centímetros, ah, pulgadas, con muchos números. Sí, no, <risa> no, no, en serio, este, le ha, ha entendido las reglas, porque si hay algo que, que yo le puedo explicar ahorita, con gusto, ahorita se lo explicamos. Fíjense que, no, ahorita, ahorita siento que voy bien, Ticho. Sí. Ajá. Siento que lo puedo manejar aún mejor de como, de como lo había comprendido antes. Sí, sí, qué bueno. Este, uh -huh. Y hay alguna habilidad que usted quisiera mejorar en inglés? Porque recuérdese que no es, algunos son buenos en lectura. Perdón, se, se, cortó, se cortó. ¿Ahorita me oye? ¿Hola? ¿Hola? ¿Me oye? Ahorita sí, ahorita Mira, sí. Se, está sí. lloviendo acá, María. Está lloviendo. Ah, por eso. ¿Y en su casa? Ajá. ¿En su casa? No. No, no, no. Va. En mi casa no. No, no. Bueno, entonces a mí me está fallando, perdón. Pues sí, le les decía si hay alguna habilidad que usted quisiera mejorar, como listening, writing, speaking. ¿En qué cree que falla usted a veces? Mm, todo. Ah, lo que más me cuesta, quizás en, en, en el listening. Listening, ah, bueno. Va, sí, mire. ajá. Le voy a recomendar un video. Se Ajá. llama Basic Listening. Basic Listening. Ajá. Que aparece un cuadro azulito. Cuadro azul. Basic Listening. Vaya. Ajá. Y ahí va a ser el siguiente ejercicio. Mire. Ajá. El ejercicio dura como unas dos horas. Pero usted Ajá. puede ir haciéndolo lentamente, ¿verdad? Una semana. Pues, dos semanas. Y ese, donde lo, ese lo encuentro en, en YouTube. YouTube. YouTube, sí. No le puedo mostrar ah, por, por derechos de autor, ¿verdad? Y todo lo demás. Pero ajá, se llama, está bien, no, no, yo lo busco. Se llama Basic Listening. Le, le digo que el, el cuadrito es azul porque hay varios ejercicios de listening. Ajá. Es que le va a ayudar muchísimo. Ya le voy a decir cómo se llama exactamente. Dice, se llama Basic Listening English ajá. Lesson. Basic Listening, English Lesson. English lesson. Ajá. Lessons, con ajá. S, con S, Lessons. Sí, Lessons. Ajá. Bueno, ahí lo va a encontrar, es un azulito. Quiero ver si le muestro sin... Bueno. Por ahí, solo un pedacito le va a mostrar, mire, tal vez lo alcanza a ver. Es el color azul. Ah, tiene ah. una orejita, ajá. Sí, correcto. Ok. Lo demás no lo puedo mostrar porque, ¿verdad? Por derechos de autor. Está bien. Sí, Ajá. muy bien. Ajá. En ese ejercicio, usted va a escucharlo una vez y la segunda vez lo va a repetir. Ajá. La tercera... ah, o sea, lo escucho y después yo lo tengo que, que narrar. Sí, 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 vale. El ejercicio le va a decir la oración, porque son oraciones, no son palabras, son oraciones. Se ah, le, va a, le va a decir la oración una vez y usted la escucha. Le va a decir ajá, la oración ajá. por segunda vez, la misma oración, a velocidad normal, y usted la repite, como sea, como caiga. Usted lo ajá. escucha y lo repite, ¿sí? Ajá. Y la tercera le va a escribir como en la oración. Se la va a enseñar a usted ya, ya escrita. Y abajo ajá. cómo se pronuncia. Si usted tiene dudas, pues, ping, le, le da pausa, ¿verdad? Y, y usted revisa ahí. Usa símbolos fonéticos ingleses, o sea, puros, ¿verdad? Ah, los que ajá. son. Ajá, cabal. No los que venden en el, en el bus, que van, venden pollecitos de dólar. Ajá. Y ahí le hacen la pronunciación a lo español, a lo, a lo pedrada. Ajá. ¿verdad? ajá. Bueno, ahí en ese ejercicio aparecen, óigame bien, tal y como se escribe y tal y como se pronuncia, ¿sí? Entonces, mi consejo es que por lo menos lo haga, uh -huh. no sé, una media hora a la semana, quizás, o cinco minutos diarios. Uh -huh. Ahí le va dando el número a la oración, uh -huh. oración uno, oración dos, y eso, o sea, 
como 200, 300 oraciones, ¿verdad? Entonces, para no perderse... Ah, usted, 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 bastante. Sí, digamos, usted practica de la 1 a la 25, por decirlo algo. Entonces, usted anota ah. de la 1 a la 25, Ajá. practiqué. Cuando vuelva a poner el video, lo pone ahí donde se quedó. ¿Sí? Ah, ese, ejer no. ese ejercicio le va a ayudar como no tiene idea. Entre más lo practique, mucho mejor va a ir avanzando. Número uno. Número dos. La música. Ah. The music. Excelente. Ay, sí. Para... Spotify es una gran sí. cosa. Sí. <ríe> Fíjense que sí. alguna, algunas palabras y algunas... Eh, algunas eh, expresiones o forma de cómo pronunciarlas sí. las he aprendido sí. con la música entonces sí. el Spotify quien tiene lo chivísimo que tiene la letra ponga ahora we are the champions esa les envía ahora el grupo ¿eh? ah sí sí la vi una tarde I pay my dues. So, okay. so I'm after time. fanático de los doors ah no de Queen es ese Queen sí Queen ajá okay. Es una canción que le dedica a la Alianza Fútbol Club. Sí. Oh, ¿Y por qué la Alianza? Ni lo conocía el señor este. ¿Qué le pasa, María? Si él era un Ay, por Alianza. Favor. O sea. Ay, por favor. Ah, oh, teacher. Okay. Soy, okay. Su imaginación es muy grande. Sí. sí. Ok. Y por último, tiene Netflix. Ajá. Tiene Netflix. No. Oh. No. Disney. No. Ninguna de esas de esos streaming tengo. Ah, qué regada, porque es una forma sí. excelente. Quizás tendría que suscribir. Es que lo que pasa es que no me queda mucho tiempo, Ticho. Ah, bueno. Entonces, bueno. entonces, siempre he considerado que es una pérdida de dinero porque no tengo para pasar viendo películas. Sí. Y, o sea, sí me gustan semana. las películas. Ni el ¿Vale? fin de semana, ni el fin de semana. No, porque por lo general visito a mi familia, voy a la iglesia, tengo que ir de compras, tengo que hacer algún trámite, o a veces tengo que resolver algo en la oficina, en, o tengo alguna consejería, entonces se, se me complica claro, de claro. todas las actividades, no. Bueno, no tengo mucho queda, tiempo quedémonos para... con la música y esos ejercicios, ah, oiga, ajá. Para, para comenzar, ¿verdad? porque les aseguro, hay un montón de, de cosas. El ejercicio que hicimos ahora, por ejemplo, ¿le costó a usted? El de ahora. Sí, me costó. Pa, eh. por, sí, por lo menos yo pensaba que vos estaba cocinando. Ah. <risa> sí. Lo que le entendía es que estaba cook. Entonces, ah, está en la cocina. No, yo pensé, Entonces, que nada, estaba, claro. yo pensé que estaba jugando capirucho. <risa> Entonces, nada que ver, o sea, me, me sí, causó sí, risa. Bueno, porque... pero por lo menos anda cerca. Es que lo que pasa, vaya, con los ejercicios de Lisa, no es que uno tiene que estar correcto, no. O usted lo escuchó o no lo escuchó, simplemente, ¿verdad? A la próxima va a ir mejorando uh -huh. y así. Así es la, los ejercicios. Así que. Sí, quizás, quizás como de, de ir entrenando, ¿verdad? Sí, correcto, sí. Bueno, alguna Sí, porque otra... pienso que ahorita con alguna canción así que que me gusta, o sea, me gusta para cantar, la verdad, para no hacer tanto el ridículo, <ríe> me aprendo la letra. Entonces sí. hay algunas cosas, entonces ahí pues como voy aprendiendo a pronunciarlos. Excelente, es una buena uh -huh. práctica, ¿verdad? A veces hay algunas fallas de gramática, pero en general... Uh -huh. O, unos, o unas contracciones algo raras, algo o algunos, rara, sí. algunos, algunos modismos norteamericanos bien extraños, porque he buscado alguna palabra que nunca la había visto, y son como expresiones bien juveniles, modernas. Sí, correcto. Entonces, así como, ¡oh! O sea. Sí, sí, yo entiendo. Igual que en español sucede, ¿verdad? Con los milenios. Ah, ajá. Entonces bueno. ya uno ya queda algo perdido. Sí, uh -huh. correcto. ¿Alguna otra pregunta extra, María? No, teacher. No, no, no. Va, excelente. No. Entonces, le agradezco su participación y pues cualquier cosa ahí estamos a la orden en el WhatsApp y en las clases ah. también, por supuesto. Vale. ¿no? Muchas gracias a usted por su okay. tiempo. Y me okay. gusta la forma tan dinámica de notar la clase. Ah, ok, good. Por ahí le, le manda saludos de Dudley, oiga él. Ah, <risa> el... okay. sí, me gusta. Okay. Have a good night, María. God bless you. Bye, bye. Good night, teacher. Good night. Bye.